Hey guys, Charlie here. We're gonna make some shrinky dinks with the Disney Mickey Mouse book, the special shrink film, and these permanent markers. So let's get started. Okay, this is a brand new pack of markers, so let me open it up. This is a new pack of film, so let's open it up. This stuff is cool. It's shrink film by graphics. You can bake your art and watch it shrink. So let's open it up and get a piece. Does anybody remember overhead projectors? That's kind of what this film feels like. It wouldn't surprise me if it was the same stuff. Okay, and then the other thing, we are going to, because this is a pretty cool book. It shows you how to draw Mickey Mouse and his friends, but we are going to go to the back, and we're going to draw some of these. So we'll just put our film over this. Okay. Let's start out with Mickey. So we get our black marker out. So this is going to be pretty cool if you guys have never done this before. What it allows you to do is on the special film, you get to draw in color in magic or in permanent marker. And then we put it in the oven, and it's gonna shrink. So we can basically make our own shrinky dinks. If anybody remembers what those are. And I'll walk you through the whole process. It takes a little bit of time, because you gotta trace out your characters and color them in. But it is so worth it. Let's color Mickey Mouse in. I'm gonna get my thin marker. Okay, we got our Mickey Mouse. Now, let's do Donald. Let's see, we're not finished with Mickey. Let's move it out of the way so we can see everything. Now, I already color on acrylic. Grayson already colors on acrylic, so this is a cool new thing that you can do. Then what we're going to do is we're going to color these in. Then we're going to stick them in the oven. So make sure you have a parent around. We'll put them in the oven at 350 degrees for just a few minutes. And you'll see in this video what happens when we do that. It's super, super cool. Gotta do his shoes. Hey. Yellow and yellow is not helpful. Now I don't have a white to do his hands or his gloves, but that's okay. This will be good enough. How cool is that? Okay, now let's do Donald. I'm gonna use a thin marker on Donald because his lines are pretty thin. These are going to shrink about 50% in size. So they're going to be small because it's going to be pretty cool. Okay, Donald's done. So let's color him in. Okay, I put this on a white background so that we can see what we were coloring. All right. Let's do Donald. He wears a lot of blue. Got his shirt done. I'm gonna do the inside of a shirt a lighter color just to make a little bit of contrast. Yes, generally the inside is gonna be darker than the outside, but I wanted his main shirt to be pretty close to the right color. So I'm just going to use a light blue on the inside to make that contrast. There we go. So got to add the piping on his sleeves. 
Now, the closest thing I have to Orange is this. And I know that's not quite as close as he is for his speed, but we're going to use that. Because that's the closest thing I got. We got to his red bow tie. He's got such a cute red bow tie. Now, I know he's more of a yellowy orange, but still. Just to be fun, I'm going to make the bottom of his foot here pink. Just give it a little bit more contrast. So it'll look kind of cool when it's all shrunk. Because he's going to be small when it's done. It's going to be exciting. Again, I wish I had a white so I could color him in, but I don't. How cool is that? Alright, let's fill in some of the spots on Mickey. It won't really matter because this is all going to be shrunken and small, but... But I want it to look cool. Okay. So. After I finish this one part. Next, what we have to do, is I gotta finish his legs, is, um, cut him out, and then we're gonna go put him in the oven, and we can watch him shrink. So we take our scissors, make sure you're careful, just leaving some extra stuff around the edges. This is a fun project to do by yourself, at least the coloring part, but it's good to do it as a family. You can all sit down and do your own favorite Disney character, and then you get to all make them shrinky. But you make sure you have a parent because you're going to be playing around with an oven and things are going to get super hot. Donald Duck. Do our Mickey Mouse. Hey, get over here. Those are Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck. So let's go see them shrink. Let's go. Now we put it on 350 degrees, set it to bake, and now let it get hot. Wow, look at that. It only takes a few seconds. Okay, let's get him out and take a look. Let's turn this guy off. I probably could have let him cook for a little bit longer, but check it out. Isn't that cool? It could be a little bit flatter, but I probably didn't let him cook quite long enough. But that's so awesome! That big Mickey Mouse that we drew came down to this little bitty thing. And it's clear. And it's made out of plastic. So you can hang it in a window, put it on your book bag. Just to give you an idea of the size, that's the size of the Sharpie we were using. And it brought him down to be that small. That's so crazy. That's so crazy. This has been an exciting thing that I'm going to continue doing. We got our nice little Dino Duck. We got our nice little Mickey Mouse. And we have a lot more pieces to go. So I hope you guys learned a lot and enjoyed this. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. We'll see you later. Be good. Okay, bye.